Hello, good evening. Good evening. How's everybody doing? How are you? Good? Good. Thank you. Fine. Okay. Excellent. Okay, very good. Let's wait one minute for our friends. Where are you in the platform? What exercise are you on? Send me send me a chat. Tell me. I am in the number four. I will begin tomorrow, number four. Okay. Send me a chat. Put it in the chat. Okay. Okay, let me see. Where are you in the platform? Hey, put it on the chat. Put it on the chat. What exercise are you in the platform? Where are you? Donde están? En la plataforma. Where are you in the platform? Put it in the chat. Pónganlo en el chat. No lo han puesto todavía. Hello. Pónganlo en el chat. Estoy esperando para ver qué vamos a hacer. Put it in the chat. Where are you in the platform? So please write it in the chat. Okay, very good. Today I finished number three, section number three, right? I think you're referring to. Yes? Yes, section number three. Okay. So ya, ya está por el examen, eh, el midterm, el examen de la mitad. Yes. Uh -huh. okay, ya estás iniciando. Okay, okay. very good. Eh, ¿Quién más? Put it, on, put it on the chat. Okay. 3.4, knowledge check, okay, very good. Eh, Beatriz, Jose, Gaby, Jaime, Elvis, Brian, Romel, ¿dónde están en la plataforma? Put it, put it on the chat. Oh. Ok, Elvis 2.11, vas un poquito atrasado, Elvis. Ahora vamos a iniciar a las 3. Ya voy a avanzar, teacher. Ok, Elvis, vaya. Ok, sí. Very good, ok. What else? 2.9, ok, very good, ok, excellent. Ok, very good. Ya vamos ahí, ya vamos a llegar ahí. Very good. Ok, all right, excellent. So, eh, más o menos estamos ahí casi todos iniciando la tres. All right, very good. So, let's go to a, to a warm up. Let's do a, a warm up. Do you know what a warm up is? A warm up es un calentamiento. A warm up. Ok, so eh, we did two lessons yesterday. We practiced eh, this, that, these, those. Yesterday, remember? ¿Qué más hicimos ayer? ¿Qué más hicimos ayer? ¿Se, ¿Se acuerdan? ¿Qué otra cosa hicimos? Money and the numbers. Preposition. Las preposiciones. Ah, prepositions. Eh. Prepositions. Very good. Excellent. 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 Money. Ah? Money. And Money. Numbers. Yes. Yes. Number money. Yes, we talked about money. We talked about numbers. Good job. The and the questions. Yes. Yes or questions. no questions? Yes. 
Very good. Yes or no questions and WH questions. Okay, so hagamos un calentamiento. Let's let's do a two speaking activities. Okay, we're gonna go into groups and we're gonna we're going to do two speaking activities. La primera va a ser el uso de this, this, that, these, those. Okay, so you can show uh, your 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 partner, the person that you're speaking to, you can show them what do you have in your bag. Esa va a ser la primera. La segunda actividad que vamos a hacer va a ser el prepositions. Remember, sacamos la cajita and we said uh, the quarter is on top of the box. The quarter is in front of the box. The quarter is behind the box. Next to the box. In the box. Okay, remember in the box. So we did this this exercise, okay? So we're going to do the speaking exercise. Vamos a usar this, that, these, and those, and then we're going to do prepositions, okay? So vamos a vamos a hacer esa presentación, okay? So we're going to go into groups, and eh, si pueden prendan su cámara porque si no pues no los podemos ver. No sabemos no sabemos qué nos está enseñando que or si está usted en lo correcto o no. Okay, so uh, turn on your camera and we're gonna go into groups. Ok, eh, Valeria, te voy a asignar un grupo, ok, vamos a hacer la dinámica que hicimos ayer. All right, ya te va a explicar tu, tu grupo. Okay. Ya te van a explicar okay. ellos lo que estamos haciendo. Ok, very good. Gloria, okay. ya la voy a poner en otro grupo también. Ok, uh, Jaime, acepte la invitación para ir al grupo. No. Okay. Get Empieza primero. usted mejor, Graciela. Okay. Who's gonna go first? Okay. This is my pen. These are my pens. Uh, Lejos, far away. Yes. Mm -hmm. This is my notebook. Mm -hmm. These are my pillows because I am in the bedroom. Yes. Very good. Excellent. This okay. Is, go, all. continue, continue. Uh, go. This is my bed. Um, yes. Let's see. This, uh, this is my cell phone. That is my cell phone, far away. Mm -hmm. um, those are my, my shoes. Very good. Uh, those, are, those, are my, those are my husband shirts. Okay. And those are my husband pants. Very good. Very good, Garacela. Thank you. Excellent job. Okay, next. Atrás. Atrás. Y de what? ¿Cuál me falta? Ah, in front. Of, no lo puedo pronunciar muy bien. The box. Ese es frente. In front of. In front of. Okay. Yes. Uh huh. Okay. Okay. Y ya hicieron el this and that, these, those. Ah, okay. Okay. Si quieren tomar cinco minutos para ese y cinco minutos para el otro. Okay. So go. Make sure everybody goes. Okay. 
en este caso. The gate is in front of the bots, que sería enfrente. Si digamos que la tuviera atrás, sería the gate is behind the bots. Uh -huh. eh, sobre sería the gate is on the bots. A la par, the K is next to the bots. Y abajo next. sería... Repeat, Ramel, next to. Next to. Next, next to. to. Next to. Como, como next flip. Casi next flip. <laughs> next. Next. Next to. Ahí está. Do. Very good, okay. Y abajo sería, the K is under the bots. Mm -hmm. Excellent. Good job. Okay, next. Who's going to do the, the demonstrator? Who's next? Uh, yo. Okay. The quarter is front in the box. Ah, ese todavía no. Vamos a hacer this and that, these and those. Primero los demostrativos. This, that, these and those. ¿Ya hicieron esos? Sí, yes. eso ya lo hicimos. Yes. Ah, ya lo hicieron. Oh, ok, ok, ok. Entonces, eh, ¿todos ya pasaron con los demostrativos? Sí, yes. Todos, ok. Entonces, continue. Continue, Gloria. Go. Okay. Do the, the box. The quarter is front in the box. Uh, the quarter is behind the box. And the quarter is next to the box. Uh, the quarter is on the box. The quarter is in the box, mm -hmm. and the quarter is under the box. Very good. Excellent job. No sé. Creo que es en serio. Ahora lo voy a hacer yo, solo que yo sí no voy a activar la cámara porque no me funciona. Pero lo voy a hacer con un pencil y que va a estar en una mesa. Sería the pencil on the table. Sería que está sobre la mesa. The pencil on the table. La siguiente sería the pencil behind on the table. Que sería que estaría detrás de la mesa. The pencil en is the table so is, is in front of repeat in front of in front of the pencil in front of the table okay lo único que te falta ahí es el verb to be cuando tú dices the pencil is está the pencil, the pencil is, is. The pencil is in front of the table. Yes. Uh -huh. The pencil is next to the table. Que estaría a la par. Mm -hmm. La siguiente sería the pencil is the under the table. Estaría debajo. Ok, excelente. Good job. Next. Ya lo hicimos. Las tres. Todas. ¿Y los demostrativos? Ah, ese vamos a hacer ahorita. Ok. Oh, ¿Verdad que ahí nada más es de complementar las palabras, verdad? Con el in, con. Complementar con palabras. Ajá. Ok. Gracias. Ya lo demostrativo, that, lugar. Plural, el, el this are y el those are. Plural. 
This are my pencil. This are my pencil. Cuando está cerca. Cerca, lo tengo cerca. This are my pencil. Those are my pen. Cuando está lejos, ¿verdad? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. This, those are my pen. Those are my pen. Let's mm -hmm. plural, singular y plural. Entonces el singular sería, this is a pen. Y el primero uh -huh. sería, these are a pens. Uh -huh. Those are my pens. Cuando está lejos, ¿verdad? El plural, 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 cuando está lejos. Those are my pens. Correcto. Uh -huh. Those uh -huh. are my pens. Uh -huh. Those are my pens. Está lejos. Estamos hablando de varios lapiceros. Uh -huh. uh -huh. Y these are my pen cuando está cerca. Y tengo varios lapiceros. Mm -hmm. These are my pen. Ah, ok. Sure. Yo, a salir. This is my watch. That is my watch. Okay, very good. We're back. Now, uh, this is a, este era un warm up, pero a la misma vez es algo que ya hicimos. Okay? Si sienten que les, les está costando, entonces tienen que repasar y estudiar un poquito más. Ahí están las clases, ahí están los videos, ahí están la, las, los ejercicios de gramática que yo les mandé extra. Eh, ahí tienen todo. Ok. So, I need a, a volunteer, one volunteer for the demonstratives, these, that, and one volunteer for the um, prepositions. ¿Quién quiere pasar? One volunteer. Okay. Graciela, very good. Okay. Who else? Okay. Uh, La Claribel, okay, very good. So uh, Graciela, you can do the purpose, uh, the, the this and that. Okay. Demonstrators. This is my pencil. That is my pencil. These are my pillows. Those are my pillows. Excellent, excellent. Eh, Gra Graciela, quiero que baje el micrófono. Bájelo. No. Ahora, hágame una prueba, un demostrativo de él. Okay. Ah, okay. This is my pen. Ok. Ay, pare ahí. Quería escuchar cómo, se, cómo sonaba cuando usted está hablando con el micrófono así, bien cerca de su boca. O cuando el micrófono está así nomás. Y se, okay. se escucha mejor cuando el micrófono está así bajo. Es que lo que sucede es que está lloviendo muy fuerte. Ah. Como el, el techo es lámina, pensé okay. que no se escuchaba. ¿verdad? Ok, no hay, no hay problema, pero nosotros le escuchamos bien si, okay. con el micrófono así colgando, normal. Ok, okay. excelente. Ok, Claribel, now you're going to do the prepositions. Remember the prepositions in... On, on top of, in front of, next to, under. Okay, go. Solo busco una moneda. Si no, un lápiz o lo que sea. Okay. Por, porque yo sé que está lloviendo en algunos lugares. 
Si, si quieren, se pueden poner en mute si no están, no están usando el micrófono. Ok, Claribel, let's go. Preposición, ¿verdad? Yes, ready. Preposición. Uh -huh. uh, quiero ver. Uy. Perdón, se me cayó el teléfono. The penny, eh, perdón, the, the nickel. Oh, um, I don't know. Permit. Sería uh, the nickel mm -hmm. on the box. Is on the box. Is on the box. Mm -hmm. uh, the the nickel is on. Um, here in front, in, in front the bo on the box. In front of the box. The nickel of the box. Uh, the nickel is the next to on the box. The nickel, the under the box, on the box. Uh, in. 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 The nickel in on the box. No. In, está, está confundiendo in and on. In the nickel on. is okay. in the box, adentro. In, in the, the box. box. Yes, okay. very good. In the box. Yeah, that's it. Okay. All right, very good. So, practice, practice, practice. Ustedes ahí, cinco minutos. See the video. Háblanse ustedes mismos, <ríe> no hay problema. Ustedes pueden también tener su propia cuenta de Zoom, hablar con un compañero, con otra persona también que está aprendiendo, y ustedes pueden practicar. Eh, no tengan pena, porque para, para eso estamos acá. Ok. All right, very good. So, let's go to the next topic, the next topic that we have. Let me share my computer with you. Okay, the next topic, que lo que hicimos también, vimos questions with WH. Okay, so, WH questions, uh, the words. What are the words, WH? What? Where? Who? When? 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 Why? When? Why? How? Who? 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 Okay. Who? Who? Very good. So, if I want to ask a question to get more information in the present, ¿qué le voy a agregar? Verb to be. Verb to be. Yes, very good. Verb to be. So, it's going to be, for example, what is... And then the subject, your complement. And then complement. Birthday, you can say. What is your birthday? Very good. Where are you from? Are you from? Where are you from? What else? Where are you from? When? Um, when do you work? Mm, when do you work? Okay. Why? Why? Why are you late? Why are you late? Uh huh. Or why are you sad? Why are you late? Very good. How? Are today. Today. Very good. Who is quien? Who is your mom? Who is your favorite person? Very good. Who is your favorite person? Okay. Excellent. So these questions are information questions. So, I have to give information, okay? 
No puedo contestar con un sí y un no. ¿Ok? Now, ¿cuáles son las que sí puedo contestar con sí o no? Yes or no questions. Yes or no questions, right? So, example of yes or no questions. ¿Cómo empiezan? Are you a teacher? Empiezan con el verb to be, right? Are you a teacher? Are you a teacher? Or my teacher? Or our teacher? Como quieran. Are you a teacher? And then I say, yes, yes. I am. I am. Yes. Short answer. Ahí está mi respuesta. Corta. De, de hecho, hay varias formas de responder. En, en forma corta, puedo decir, yes. Or no. Okay? Or I can say, Yes, I am. Okay? No, I am not. Yes, I am. Or no, I am not. Okay? Or I can maybe, puedo usar una forma larga para responder. I can say, yes. Yes, I am the teacher. I am, I am a, a teacher. teacher. Very good. Okay? So, hay tres formas de responder. Okay? Positive, negative, and then um, this long, the long way. La forma larga. ¿Puedo usar la forma larga en negativo? Yes. No, I am not a teacher. teacher. Okay? Yes. So you can use it different ways. Okay? Very good. So with this information, lo que ustedes han aprendido, han aprendido hasta acá, tienen casi una conversación completa. Porque yo puedo presentarme con alguien. Hello, my name is Carlos. What is your name? Usando WH questions. What is your name? Where are you from? Blah, blah, blah. Y empiezo a hablar con la persona, buscando más información. And maybe I want to uh, confirm information. Usually, yes or no questions, we, we, we use them to confirm information. Are you a teacher? Oh, yes, I am. Mm -hmm. Okay, so now what I want you to do, let's take uh, 10 minutes for this exercise, okay? Vamos a como poner todo esto junto. El verb to be, el subject, uh, yes or no questions, WH questions, todo eso que hemos aprendido in a conversation, okay? So quiero que okay. se conozcan. Pregunta a la persona, what is, what is your name? How old are you? Where are you from? Um, are, are you, uh, are you, uh, what is your profession? Uh, where do you work? I, you know, cosas conociendo una persona. All right, very good. Okay. So you have everything to do it, okay? So I, estoy buscando la fluidez eh, y el uso gramatical. Okay. Prácticamente okay. quiero ver si, quiero ver si uh, están con lo que hemos aprendido hasta ahora. All right, very good. Let's go. Let's go to uh, groups now. Okay, uh, let's see. We have, let's go to, wait. Okay, quiero hacer grupos de dos y tres. All right, let's go. Okay. Hola. Okay, very good. So, who's going to go? Mm, hello, Patricia. What's your name? What's your name? Okay. Repeat. Patricia, no se la escucha muy bien. Can you repeat? 
Hi. What's your name? Ah, my name is Jaime Muñoz. Um, how old are you? Uh, I am 40, 43 years old. Um, oh, good. Where are where you are from? from? Where are you from? Uh, I I am from San Bartolomé Perulapia, Cusca Clan. Usted me pregunta entonces. What is your birthday? My birthday is 27 uh, of May. And okay. Um, why is your favorite food? My favorite food is pizza because it's very delicious. Yeah, I like to. <laughs> uh, how is your favorite person? My favorite. How how is your favorite person? Ken. Who? No, who? Ken. First person. Who, who? Sorry. Who, who is your favorite person? Favorite person. Personaje. Okay. Person. Person. Bueno, creo que perdí la señal porque ya no. Bueno. Hello, my name is Gabriela Fernández. I am from San Salvador. Jared Halls, 26th. Ok, ¿Quién, ¿quién está preguntando? ¿Quién está haciendo las preguntas? What is your name? How old are you? Where are you from? Are you a student? Tenían que hacer esas preguntas a la otra persona. Oh, okay. so, lo que hicimos es que nos your, presentamos what? y luego pregunta el nombre. Mm, bueno, sí, la presentación está bien, pero si no preguntan, entonces no van a usar el WH questions, el yes or no questions, etc. So, eh, ask, como si tú estuvieras queriendo conocer a una persona. ¿Ok? What's your profession, Gabriela? I am a profession student. Ok. Uh, when is your birthday? Like, uh, birthday. I am 20, uh, I am uh, on March. Uh, what was the, the question was, when is your birthday? Cuando, right? Uh -huh. when, when is your, is birthday? your birthday? So you have uh -huh. to give her, uh, Gabriel, Gabriela, you have to tell her, uh, in Mayo, in Junio, when is your birthday? Hello? Gabriela, Hola. está ahí? ¿Sí? Contéstale la pregunta. Ok, entonces Mónica y Romel. Si Romel, si tú la escuchas, dale. Eh, yo comienzo. What is your name? My name is Mónica Sales. Where are you from? I am from San Salvador. What is your favorite music? My, my favorite music is instrumental instrumental music 
eh, tipo de música. Eh, así, ah, ¿verdad? Así se respondería. My, my favorite music is instrumental music. No. Yes. Good, good. Continue. No se, no, no se duden. Sigan, <laughs> sigan. Continue, continue. What is your last name? Um, my last name is Sales Colato. El apellido, creo que Sales era. Sales Colato. My last name is Sales Colato. Okay. Remember the, the exercise that we did? How do you spell it? Remember? Ah, yeah. Um, e, that, that, uh, A, S, A, L, E, S, C, O, L, A, T, O. Very good. Good job. Excellent. Okay. What is your name? Roman, I am Roman Martinez. Where are you from, Roman? I am from Lourdes, Colón. How, um, how, how old are you? I am 23 years old. Oh, okay. La edad okay. era, va? Yes. Sí, sí, sí. Ah, okay, okay. <laughs> Who is your favorite artist, music artist? So My favorite uh, rap. Okay. Rap. <laughs> um, My favorite music uh, rap. Uh -huh. Where uh, where are you work? Where Come do on. you work? Come where on. do you where do you work? Uh, where do you work? Eso que es. ¿Dónde trabajas? ¿Dónde? Where do you... Okay, very good. Excellent. So, did you practice a little bit? Espero que, que, que pudieron hacer preguntas. Eso es lo importante, right? Okay, now, uh, let's have a discussion. Uh, en el chat, quiero que ustedes me hagan preguntas a mí. Okay, so in the chat, write a question for me. Okay, and I'm going to try to answer the question. So go. What is your favorite book? I like to read everything. I, I like to read uh, the Bible. I like to read. Uh, there's a book that se llama Emotional Intelligence. I like to read books, magazines, news. Where Where are you live? Nah, ahí no falta. Algo que no han estudiado todavía, pero es el, el ver, el, un verbo auxiliar, do. Entonces le vamos a poner do. Where do you live? I live in, in Nuevo Cuscatlán. What is your profession? Teacher, mostly. And what is your favorite hobby? Um, I like to work with tools, with wood. I like to uh, fish. I like to go fishing. Where, no, when is your birthday? No, birthday. B-I-B-I-R-T-H. -B okay, uh, my birthday, May, May 11. What am I doing right now? I am teaching. Uh, my wife's name is Gloria. Uh, what is my favorite food? Pizza. How old are you? I am 38. Where are you from? I was born in El Salvador, but I lived in the United States. 
Eh, have you kids? No, ahí no falta el verbo auxiliar. Do. Do you have kids? No la han estudiado todavía, pero ya lo vamos a ver. Do you have kids? Eh, not yet, but maybe may, soon. Soon I'm going to have a I'm going to have a child. Do you have kids now? No. <laughs> Who is your favorite singer? I don't know. I, I like the band. I like Maroon 5. Uh, who is your favorite movie? I don't know. I like movies like Gladiator. I like movies like... Uh, um, I like Avengers. Okay. What What is do you do? Um, maybe we need to work on that question. Eh, no sé qué me quieres preguntar ahí, but it's not correct. Um, all right, very good. Okay, do you see? That's how you practice. Y lo que estamos haciendo es teniendo una conversación en in inglés. Okay? La meta es comunicativa, la meta es poder hablar, es poder eh, hablar. Entonces, si en algún momento tú, tú te sientes incómodo, Eh, tú continúes, right? Continue, continue. No, no dejes que eso te detenga, ¿verdad? Porque con el tiempo tú mismo te vas a autocorregir. En lo que tú vas aprendiendo más, tú mismo te vas a autocorregir. Pero no, no esperes de que tú llegues a una perfección de gramática para poder hablar inglés. No, eso nunca va a pasar. No, ten, no tengo que tener una gramática perfecta antes de hablar, no, sino con lo poco que sé, yo empiezo a hablar y con el tiempo en lo que voy aprendiendo más gramática y más vocabulario, yo me voy autocorrigiendo. ¿Ok? No es que voy a estudiarme toda la gramática y después voy a hablar. No, entonces nunca va a aprender inglés, va a pasar tres años ahí. So, the thing is that you need to speak with what you have. Okay? For example, imagínense si ustedes van camping y lo único que tienen es una carpa y unos palos y un machete. ¿Van a hacer una casa? Claro que sí van a hacer una casa. No van a dormir en, 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 afuera en la lluvia, sino que bueno, tengo esto y lo que voy a hacer es trabajar con lo que tengo. Y con el tiempo yo voy mejora, mejorando así. Entonces, esa es la idea. Esa es la idea de esto. ¿Okay? Entonces, han llegado a poder sostener una conversación 50-50 con otra persona. Eso, eso es muy bueno. All right, let's go to section number three. Okay? Let's go to section number three. ¿Listos? Okay. Let's go to uh, our platform. Let's go to our course. Okay, section number three we're talking about is um, a, it's a conversation, okay? I want you to listen to this conversation because in, in this, you're going to see a lot of the things that we practice. Eh, van a identificar allí en la conversación que están haciendo preguntas con el verb to be. Yes or no questions, WH questions. Están usando eh, eh, adjectives, el possessive adjective that we study. Prácticamente están poniendo todo lo que hemos aprendido hasta ahora, lo están poniendo en una conversación. Okay? So let's listen to this conversation. Ready? Okay. Hi everyone. In this class, you'll listen to a conversation titled, Are You From Seoul? This conversation illustrates how yes, no, and WH questions are used. Are you from California, Jessica? Well, my family is in California now, but we're from Korea originally. Oh, my mother is Korean, from Seoul. Are you from Seoul? No, we're not from Seoul. We're from Daejeon. So is your first language Korean? 
Yes, it is. What I would like for you to do next is to practice this conversation. This conversation will become very useful for our future. No. Okay, very good. So, I need two people that are going to practice this conversation. ¿Quién la va a leer aquí con nosotros? So, I need a, a, maybe a, a man and a girl. Yes? Un caballero, una señorita. ¿Quién nos va a ayudar? Who wants to do it? Only, only read the conversation. ¿Quién quiere ir? Levante la mano. Uh, Gabriela, ok, very good. ¿Y quién más? Eh, ¿Un caballero? Romel, dale. Ok, so Romel, tú vas a ser Tim. Y, eh, ¿quién dije? Gabriela, tú vas a ser Jessica. Ok, so let, let's read this conversation. Romel, ¿listo? Mm, creo que Romel no está ahí. Jaime, dale tú. Jaime, dale tú. You're going to be Tim. Ok. Uh, Tim, are you from California, Jessica? Yes, well, my family is in California now, but we're from Korea, original. Oh, my mother is Korean from Seoul. Are you from Seoul? No, we're not from Seoul. We're from the... The Jones. So, the Jones. So, is your first language Korean? Yes, it is. Okay. All right, very good, excellent. Now, what type of questions do you see there? What type of questions do you see? Are you from California, Jessica? Are you from California, Jessica? Very good, okay. What type of question is this? Yes or no question, right? Yes. Yes? Yes or uh, no. Uh-huh. What other question? Are you from Seoul? Are you from Seoul? Seoul. Uh, uh, another okay. question? So is your is you language Korean? 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 Yes. Or... Very good, very good. Okay. Excellent. So this is basically lo mismo que ustedes acaban de aprender. All right, the same thing. Asking yes or no questions and then answering yes or no questions. All right, very good. Now, quiero que noten algo. Sometimes... Por, por, por eso es que la gramática no es 100% cuadrada. Yes or no question. But look at the answer. La respuesta no yes or no. Si no queda más información. Okay. So, no siempre la gramática va a ser 100% cuadrada en una cajita. Que si me preguntan eso, no puedo responder. No. This is uh, like a like a conversation between friends, okay? Preguntó una yes or no question, pero ella, ella dio más información porque ella eh, suponía de que él quería saber más. Entonces ella dio esa información. All right, so, so sometimes, you know, be, be careful with that so that you can have that. Okay, very good. Let's go to the next exercise in, the, in, in this section number three. Eh, ¿Ya vieron este video? ¿Ya lo habían visto antes? ¿Algunos sí? Sí. Yes. Yes. Ok. Let's watch this video. Um, si, si se lo pueden, es decir, si no tienen problema con, con el contenido, simplemente pues, eh, pero si quieren escribir algunas eh, respuestas, entonces... We're not from Japan. You're not. And yes and no questions would be. Let's start by looking at the examples on the screen. All the statements that you see are negative statements. I'm not from New York. You're not late. She's not from Russia. He's not from Italy. It's not English. We're not from Japan. You're not early. They're not in Mexico. 
In order to form negative statements would be, you need to follow this next formula. Okay. Quiero que noten algo. Eh, después, en, en el caso de usar eh, o responder en forma negativa, ¿dónde va el negativo? Va después del verb to be. Si ustedes ven, aquí está el verb to be. Va después. El negativo va después del verb to be. Okay. Now, eh, los otros ejemplos are questions. For example, are you from California? I am. Or, yes, I am. Or, no, I'm not. Am I early? Yes, you are. Is she from Brazil? She is. Or you can say, yes, she is. Or, no, she's not. Is he from Chile? Yes, he is. Or you can say, no, he's not. Okay? So, hay varias formas de responder estas preguntas con yes or no. Okay? Uh, questions? Preguntas acá? Questions? No? No. Okay, very good. So, I have some questions here for you. Uh, yo les mandé este documento por si ustedes lo quieren practicar después. En su tiempo. Está en el grupo de, de, de WhatsApp. All right, very good. Let me ask the questions and maybe you can answer. O, o como, como sería la respuesta. Question number one. Does Mr. Brown live in California? Yes, he does. Ah, uh, Miss, perdón, Miss Brown. Yes, she does. Very good. Y le están ayudando ahí ya poniéndole el no o el sí. Number two. Are Shelly and Thomas tired? No, they aren't. They aren't. Okay. Porque ya el no me, lo, me, me, me dice que va a ser negativa. So, aquí está mi negativo, no. Um, number three. Do penguins live at the North Pole? No. ¿Cuál sería? No, they... No, no, they don't. No, they don't. No, they don't. Okay, very good. Does your father work in an office? Yes. Yes, he, yes, he does. Yes, he does. Yeah. Yes, he now, does. aquí estamos usando el verbo auxiliar, do and does, el cual ustedes lo, lo van a ver más en detalle. In este curso. All right, very good. Does your father work in an office? Yes, he does. Okay. Is Ottawa the capital city of Canada? Yes, yes. it is. Yes, it is. It. Mm -hmm. Yes, it is. ¿Por qué uso it? Porque estoy hablando de una cosa. Mm -hmm. Yes, it is. Okay, number six. Are we late? No. No, we aren't. We no, we aren't. Or no, we're not. If you want to use. No, okay. Mm -hmm. Number seven. Does Robert live in London? No. no he doesn't. He doesn't. Very good. Sí, puede usar la contracción doesn't or does not. Cualquiera de las dos está bien. Robert, no. Uh, does Robert live in London? No, he doesn't. Uh, number eight. Is dinner dinner ready? Is dinner ready? No, it's not. Very good. No, it's not. No, it's not. Very good. Number nine. Do you like to read? Yes. Yes, I do. Yes, I do. Yes, I do. Number 10, are they from New Zealand? Yes. Yes, they are. Yes, they are. Yes, they are. Very good. Are rabbits dangerous? No. No, they aren't. No, they aren't. No, they aren't. Number 12, is Brazil in Asia? No, they it. No, it's not. It's no, not. it's not. ¿Por qué no, it? It's not. Porque estoy hablando de un país, de, de una cosa. Uh -huh. So, tengo que usar it. No, it's not. Does she drive? Yes, she does. Yes, she does. Yes, he does. 
she. Tengo que usar el mismo eh, sujeto que estamos yes. hablando en, en la pregunta. Yes, she does. does. Yes, she does. Very good. Is Mr. Smith a teacher? Yes, he is. Yes, he is. Yes, he is. Very good. Do they know the answer? No, they don't. No, they don't. Okay. No, they don't. They don't. Excellent. Now, number 16. Do you know how to swim? No, no I don't know. I don't. I don't know. No, I don't. Or, en el caso que sí, entonces sería, yes, I do. Yes, do I you know. know how to swim? No, I don't. Um, number 17. Are you angry? No, I'm not. No. 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 Number 18. Is Dubai in the Middle East? Yes. Du yes. Dubai, el país, Dubai, está en el Medio Oriente? Is it in the Middle East? Yes, it is. Yes, it is. Yes, it is. Does the cake taste good? Yes, it does. Yes, it does. Yes, it does. All right, and then the number 20, are they here? No, no they aren't. Excellent. Very good. Okay, so here I have the last exercise. We got three minutes. The last exercise is put this into a question. He loves this town. Put this into the question. Entonces tengo que usar, does he love this town? Okay. Let me see. Uh, solo quiero ver algo. <laughs> Let me check. <laughs> no, show answer, sorry. Let me see. Sí, están usando el verb. Lo mismo que hicimos en las preguntas anteriores. Están en algunos casos usando yes or no questions. En otros casos están usando do and does. Okay, very good. Uh, they like soccer. Do. Do. Do they, like soccer? Do, they, do they like soccer? Very good. Number three. She can drive a lorry. No sé qué es a lorry. Can she drive? They are nice. Number four. Question. Are they... Are they, uh, nice? they nice? Yes, very good, excellent. They they went to the swimming pool. Did they go to the swimming pool? Oh. Yes, question. Did they go to the swimming pool? Very good. Okay. Now Aquí hay una lección que to, que en la cual nosotros nos vamos a enfocar un poquito más. Es el uso de did, do y does. ¿Ok? Pero ya con la base que tienen del verb to be, no va a haber problema. All right, excellent. Um, les mandé un juego de prepositions yesterday. I think it was this one. No, bueno, voy a ir al, al, al enlace que usé. Porque... Ahorita no me acuerdo cuál era. Ayer puse un enlace de la... Ah, este, este juego. Creo que es este. No. Eh... Les voy a introducir a este, a este juego y lo pueden hacer en su propio tiempo. Um, puede que esta página le dé un mensaje que, di, que les diga si quieren activar a bot player. A bot player, diga aceptar o sí para que puedan ver este juego. Entonces, eh, Choose the correct answer. Here, you're going to see this game 
and you're going to answer, va a usar in, on, under, in front of. Okay? All right. Este lo pueden jugar. Se lo voy a poner aquí. Okay? So, si quieren jugarlo ahora yeah. o mañana. mañana. Okay. Very good. So, I'll see you tomorrow, okay? Continue practicing section number three. Continúen con la sección tres. Pueden revisar los prepositions si no les quedó claro. Eh, el video que, estaba, que estábamos viendo de último de la plataforma, enfóquense en, en ese para yes or no questions. Ok. I'll see you tomorrow then, ok? See you. Good night. Good night. Ok. Good night. Good night. Good night. Bye. Good night.